All right, we have got a fifth wheel travel trailer. As you can see, it's sitting on the ground. I guess the gentleman that owns it was trying to get hooked back up to it and misaligned the hitch a bit. And when he bumped into it, the landing gear collapsed and now it's on the ground. So we're going to see if we can fix that with the wrecker. I'm not exactly sure or how we're going to do that, but uh, we'll figure something out or we will give up and go get ice cream because it's hot outside today. So see how this goes. So, good, I'm Casey. Casey, Chris, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So those, those are definitely done. Yeah. So, so if we would have liked to do it, what I'm trying to do is get up high enough just so I can get in my receiver. Yeah. And deal with the rest of it. Yeah. So what I'm trying to figure out is... I might be able to get sideways and reach over here with the boom and lift up. Problem is this sticks out. So. Is that? There's nothing. This is all. This yeah, is all but I'm saying if I if I sling under that with the boom to lift, that sticks out past that. So. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Um, there's nothing as far as weight though. There's nothing. There's nothing heavy in the front. Okay. Uh, so it's all just fiberglass and aluminum basically. Okay. Whatever. Wood. All right. Um, I'm gonna see if I can get sideways to it and reach out far enough to make that work. Okay. Yeah. So, okay, so wheels are chalked. You know, my might be able to pull a little forward on that. So, slack the cables. See. We'll leave that one hooked up. We'll take this one off. Hopefully we got enough reach. I can back up a little more. I'm going to back up just a hair. Okay, I think we might be okay there. So we are going to want my oldest flat strap. And the shackle. This in the hook, and then pull in our winch some. Stay. Get you tucked up on there good. We're probably going to ruin the strap doing this, but that's okay. 
Okay. Okay. We've got it coming up. We're real close to that sheep head. Okay, you want to back your truck in just right close to this wheel lift as you can. Actually, I pull these off and get a few inches closer. Don't get under that. Straight back, yeah. Right there. Stop. Pull up on it. Okay. All right, straight back. Stop. Okay, we're gonna bring the boom in some because that needs to come over and down. So boom in should be that. A little up, a little in. Okay, back a little. Back, stop there. Okay, let's see if there's any way of getting that out of there. Let's think about this. Yeah, I got one right here. Let's try it I'm going to split this block. Uh, just hold on a sec. I don't want to be too much in here for this part. Yeah, it's okay. There we go. That's okay. I can move this over to the other side. See if this will do anything. Everything I need to do is right in the way of what I need to do. Want to hold down on this? Sure. Just hold that down against the bed rail. There we go. All right, I'll go loosen up that jack and then you can back into it. Okay. okay. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. If not, we'll pick it up again. No. No, I, I'm going to put it off the clutch on the back. I was talking to you, trying to hurry. Yeah. I'm going to put it off the clutch and I hit those. 
Oh. Get the thing off center and just fuck with that arm like front of the butter. Cool. And once that one arm went, the other arm just like went up into the receiver. You couldn't hold the whole weight? No. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot of weight on the front of that. Actually, that'll be okay. Go ahead and back up. Uh, pull forward on it. It didn't go in on its own, so. Okay, good. Yes, I know that ram is leaking very, very bad, but this truck hasn't set still long enough to pull it off and get it rebuilt, so it's still leaking. I don't ever worry about the top layer being pulled tight because all that just comes right back off before you use it anyway. Okay, quiet. Get our wheel grids back. Oh, guess there's some dirt in them. All right, well, you're all set to go. Thanks. No problem. Okay. That was probably not the correct way to do it. And uh, trying to get the uh, strap out put me in a little bit more of a sketchy situation than I wanted to be, but it worked. So we'll call it a win. I think we still need ice cream because it's still hot. So let's go do that. <laughs>